city, you saw some sunshine. The rain came with the cold front, the sun come back out. Now the temperatures are just falling here as we go through the evening hours and they will continue to fall as cold air just funnels in the South Florida after that front moved on through really opening up the gates for that colder air to move on in. Wind is gusty out there right now and we have a wind chill advisory for the feels like temperature. The wind chill in the morning is going to feel like the 30s across our area. Of course, up north, that's nothing but for us. That's the criteria for a wind chill advisory. Temperatures currently are all in the 50s up and down the coastline. And uh, with that gusty wind, it feels a few degrees cooler than that. Now, city by city here, let's check on your neighborhood and see what you're going to look like in the morning. And I think everybody's going to see chilly temperatures. 43 in Wellington, but the wind chill is going to be in the 30s. 45 in Lake Worth, 45 also in Boca. On the Treasure Coast, Port St. Lucie, 40 degrees, 39 in Sebastian, 38 in Okeechobee. Again, wind chill with those breezy west and northwest winds. They're going to really make it feel cooler. Tomorrow afternoon, not warming all that much. We're staying in the 50s on the Treasure Coast, 59 in Hobe Sound, 58 Stewart. Uh, temperatures barely pushing 60 degrees in the Palm Beaches, 60 in West Palm, 62 in Boca, still 59 in Jupiter. A lot of sunshine, northwest wind blowing. It's unchanged all day long, and that's a cold wind for us, so it continues to push in some cooler air. Even through Sunday, the winds don't change all that much, maybe a little bit of north in it by the end of the day, but then they go back offshore. So I think now Monday will be a chilly morning also, and I've lowered temperatures. New model runs have come in, and I pushed down temperatures a bit. Notice now Sunday not quite near 70, more like the mid 60s, but we'll get there. By Monday, we're in the mid 70s, back to near normal, and then we're, hey, we're back into the 80s by Thursday and Friday. Rain chances stay pretty low here. If you didn't get the rain today, probably not much for the next at least five days. Humidity stays low, but it will eventually go up here without another big cold front coming. We'll get back to at least close to the muggy category by the end of the week. Of course, our falling iguanas here, we're gonna see that the next two mornings will be pretty chilly. In fact, tomorrow night will be a colder night than tonight. Bodie and Beach forecasting is getting pretty, getting pretty rough out there. Gusty west northwest wind. We got a swell showing up Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. All look like uh, wavy conditions. Great for the surfers finally after a, a flat week, week and a half or so. Chilly in the morning here, 38. I lowered that too. My newest model runs coming in much colder, 48 on Monday morning. But then, like I said, we get back to near 80 by Thursday and Friday.